Hi, in this video I'll be looking into some cool styling tips in QGIS 2.6. I'll start with a shape burst fill as a foundation for my building symbols. Shape burst isn't new, but the color pickers, and with it a key functionality for my symbols, namely opacity. I'm using the exact same color for everything, except the second shape burst color but I'm varying the opacity for each part of the symbol. To frame the fill, I'm adding an outline by the old method and a no brush fill style. You can also use a simple line just as outline. Next, I'm adding a marker line with two slightly different markers. They will have the same color, but different size and width. But more importantly, they will have different angles. This will create a rough look for the line. It would actually look, look even better if you use two different marker lines with slightly different intervals, but you can experiment with that yourself. One marker will be angled 95 degrees and the other 85 degrees. Finally, I'm adding another marker line, but this time the markers are not at an interval, but on every vertex. This may not be completely necessary, but I think it frames the symbol nicely. Last of all, I'm adding an overall transparency for the layer. What do you think? I think QGIS is awesome. See you next time.